Hello again YouTube and welcome to the final part of Let's Play Feeding Frenzy 2 Shipwreck Showdown. Um, I'm on level 56, I think that there are 60 levels overall, or 59, I can't really remember, it would make sense to have 60. But this video is going to last as long as it takes for me to finish the game, so I'm not, I'm not going to make another part, I'm just going to go for it. Um, based on the name of the level, Tricky Treats and what it says, um, we're going to have a really difficult first level fish to get, so let's go. Yeah, cuttlefish and puffer fish. At least we've got quite a large area, so we wouldn't have trouble. And it said to avoid poison fish at all costs. Oh, this is going to be a long level. If I don't do very well at it. Oh god, there are like whales in this part of the ocean. Get the shrink. Oh, what? Alright. Oh, I was trying to go for the uh, shrink mushroom thing, but you saw how successful that was. I suppose I should rely on those power ups. Always at the wrong way that the pufferfish do that. Yeah, whenever you head in the direction of the screen, you've probably noticed this already, and I've probably commented on it before. But you can see what's behind you, but not what's in front of you very easily, and that's kind of bad. And I just ate like several pufferfish, but that's fine. Just gotta take it slowly and carefully. Ah, oh, see? I'm pretty sure he only just depuffed. Right. Okay. I'm gonna try and put a little bit of concentration into this. Just so that I don't have to spend too long doing each level. Right. Oh, yeah. Whales are usually nearer the surface, and they're quite hard to avoid. <laughs> That's three in a row that I failed to eat. Okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. Sorry if the commentary isn't dynamically interesting, but I've got to make sure that I concentrate it for at least a little bit. Okay, now things will get a little bit easier. Yeah, so the, this is the last part, uh, and then we'll go on to defeat the final boss, and then I don't know whether I will continue straight away with the next Let's Play, or I should just keep on with just doing two in a row, because before I just felt like doing three at the same time. It began with Insane Aquarium Deluxe, Spore, and Dungeons of Dreadmoor, but now... Uh, I don't know. The Neverwinter Nights takes a bit more dedication, so... I'm not sure what I should do on that front. Um, mostly I'll just wait. I'm, t I'm tempted to do, as Avia suggested, and do the uh, Age of Mythology Let's Play. Um, it may be including the Titans expansion as well, but... I tried to reinstall the game uh, yesterday, and the Age of Empires, um, not Age of Empires, Age of Mythology uh, disc, uh, I'm not sure whether it's scratched or whether it just generally has a data problem, but I installed it, but it had one error, um, something to do with the models, and basically the game does run and it's all, all fine, but I can't actually see any units or trees or buildings or anything. I can highlight them and I can also see with the Titans expansion I can see all the Atlant Atlantean units but no town centers and things like that. So I'll have to see. So that'll be on hold until I, maybe I can get a new disc. Okay, still going strong. Um, I don't know whether I actually had the graphic settings turned down, but when I turned the game on and then checked the options, because I accidentally full-screened it, um, 
I saw that the graphics were turned to low, so I put them up to high, but it didn't seem to make any difference. That's understandable. Ugh. How many points have I lost to these stupid puffer fish? And now that my fish kind of fills most of the screen. <laughs> you can just hear that annoying sound of just bouncing off all the time. But we got it. I mean, the whales aren't going to get us now, are they? Except if I got the poison fish and made me rush into another whale. I'll just keep on going to different areas of the map, because it's really the leopard fish that I need. Or leopard sharks. There we go. That helped. Problem is, if you're so big, you're more prone to eating the um, poison minnows. Just one more. Yes. Phew. At least that one was cleared. See if I can reach the next level of food bank before the end of the game. We're still a cutterfish consumer. Pull the trigger. Yeah, it is 60, I think. Uh, Layla steps up for the boss battle. Oh, I forgot I was supposed to be using mines. <laughs> I thought I could just run away and be fine. There we go, actually got it in a deep ocean bit. There we go. And getting there, getting there. And that's that for the boss. Flawlessly done. And we're gonna chase it off. Oh, I see. Pull the trigger. Queen Triggerfish. Alright. Oh, so close to the 8,000. We will get it then. Back to Boris. This is the fish that we had at the start. We're now to the original hero of Boris. I... I do like the art design for Boris, and I just realised looking at the top, I can only eat butterflies and mayflies for the first stage, so I just have to stay at the top of the water, really. Oh my! <laughs> I thought the pelican had already gone. Alright. We're getting there. Any power ups down here? Yes, there are a few. Got a triple flip there. Come on, I'm trying to get that power up. Alright. So now I can eat the light blue ones. Oh. Damn. I thought I could eat the pink ones. For some surreal moment. Ouch. I swear they're just loitering at the top here to catch, catch me. There we go. Mega frenzy. Mega frenzy. Can't really jump as high. Or Mega maybe I am jumping to the same height, but I'm just Mega big, so. So I don't notice it as much. Ah, oh, this has been quite a pleasant level. Much easier than the last one. Yet somehow I failed. And here we are, 216 butterflies, nice. Still caught a fish consumer, so we need to reach 8500. Welcome to the madhouse. 
all living things sense the danger. The approach of the intruder spawning cycle has driven local fish life into a frenzy. Oh, there you go. Um, so... Everything's come to the reef. Everything's gone crazy. So this will be the last fish level itself, because then it'll be just the boss fight at the end. Barracuda bite. Just gonna continue to annoy the barracuda. There's like barely any fish as well. Oh. Oh, I thought I was gonna eat the stun power up. Oh well. Feeding frenzy. Feeding frenzy, yay. The name of the game. Hopefully, like, all my audacity and stuff is still recording. And of course, because I glanced away, I got eaten. Pay attention, me. Or I'll continue to die and then we'll never finish this let's play. Yeah, so don't forget to say in the comments what you thought of the let's play. I'm just saying this ahead of the credits. Um, and, again, what you'd like to see in the future if that future ever arrives, because I fail so badly. Okay, I'm just going to try and stay near the bottom instead then. Great, loads of fish just gravitate towards the bottom. Go to the top. Mm, again, the kind of off-screen off problem. Uh, do I do anything but whine about my games and just point out every one of their flaws? Because usually, it's much more enjoyable than, than I make out. Stay very still. Gonna be very cautious and slow. Double frenzy. Alright, get that and that. Oh, why? I thought for a moment I could eat them. It's okay. I'm gonna start whispering now. I don't want to become I don't want to become really bad at the game again. Don't take me back there. Ugh, at least you don't have to start the game all over if you lose all your lives. You can just carry on from where, wherever you were. I can't remember if you had to repeat the whole game in the first game, but you might have. You might have. <clears throat> All right, take it slow. No! Oh, I thought he wasn't gonna turn around. All that progress is gone. Ugh. But that's it. No more nonsense. I'm just gonna charge around, eat everything, just, just go. Just power eat everything. Didn't work. Didn't work. Uh, I feel like everything's closing in. <laughs> if, if only I could just get to the second stage, then everything would be fine. Because other, otherwise, I'm kind of living on this sort of. Yes, I'd like to continue. I'm living on this kind of scant, few tiny fish that are left. But even if I try and stay in the same place, all the fish gravitate towards me. So there you go, I would have been eaten by that shark, but quick reactions. Super frenzy. And I thought Boris, like when we last left him, was big enough to eat all of these fish. Except for the sharks. Whatever happened to being herbivorous? That shark so almost got me. Yeah, I think the goat fish things are the most infamous for turning around. At 
the last moment. Come on, we're almost there. We're almost there. Yes. Oh, thank God. I managed to grow before that happened. Now it's going to be marginally easier if I can eat the light blue fish. I think they're all just going to try and close in on the bottom. Ah, oh, see what I mean about them turning around? Most other fish don't tend to do that. I tend to just run headlong into sharks most of the time. Triple frenzy. Let's see if we can build up to mega frenzy. Get lots of points. Mega frenzy. Mega frenzy, there we go. Aha. Oh, that last part was just so easy. Just like eat everything. Have we gotten enough? Oh, not quite. <laughs> Hopefully we'll get one at 8500. And the very last level, Monsterific, in which the fate of the planet is decided. The infection cycle. Not really sure what that will do, but... Oh. I was trying to get it to, you know, swim into a mine. Apparently it doesn't like the poison minnows though. I've also got the cuttlefish to have as well. Ah, uh, the boss is so tiny now when it used to like fill the entire ocean. Come on, we're almost there. We're so near the end. If I die twice, then <laughs> we'll lose. Like, so close to the end. Eating the cuff cuttlefish, because, you know, we can definitely grow in this level. Ugh. And the last one, no. Ah, oh, so close. Uh, the poison minnows are just there to slow down the level, really. And there are no mines, there are no mines. <laughs> wow, I was so lucky there. And... Crunch! Stage cleared. And the total reaches over 9,000! We're an extreme eater. You defeated the intruder and same, saved Frenzy Coast from unimaginable danger. The Frenzy Coast has found a new hero. Probably Boris, maybe me. And that's it, I think we're here. Uh, I think that's the previous one that we got to. But that's it, uh, let's just roll, show the credits. And that will be it for Let's Play Feeding Frenzy 2 Shipwreck Showdown. Um, there don't even seem to be like many people who actually really worked on the game. It's quite simple, and I like that. Um, uh, I'd say it was fairly enjoyable. There were a few rough patches in which I mildly got a little bit frustrated because of my failure, not not because of the game. Um, but yeah, I, I think it's pr a pretty solid game. I think you can get it from Steam for however much it was. Mostly I just wait uh, for sales on Steam if I'm ever going to buy it. But, um, yeah, I, I, I would advise uh, checking this game out and maybe playing it a bit. Uh, and it stuck with my fish theme. I, w I don't know what other fish games there are around. I'll have a look, because uh, people seem to <laughs> like the fact that I play the fish games. Which is pretty nice. Um, yeah, so I want to really thank you for watching, especially if you've watched all the way through. I think I only reached nine or ten parts, so that's that's still fine. But yeah, um, there wasn't actually that much story, was there? But <laughs> okay, um, yeah, uh, I don't really have anything else to say, um, only to say thank you again. 
for watching and I will see you with my let's my next let's play see you then